Another important dimension of Divine Mercy Devotion is the image. Jesus appeared to St. Faustina Kowalska once when she was praying and he said he wanted her to paint the image of Divine Mercy, which eventually was done. A professional painter came in and painted the image, which you can see before my eyes in this YouTube. Jesus promised that many, many blessings would flow from those who venerate the image of Divine Mercy. I'm just going to give a short explanation of the image itself. See that the head of Jesus is surrounded by a halo, and that represents the holiness of Jesus Christ. He has his hand raised up, his right hand is raised up in blessing, which means that Jesus wants to bless all of us, especially those who have the divine mercy image in their homes, enthroned in their homes. Then Jesus is dressed in white, which is symbolic of purity. We're all called to live a life of purity. Then Jesus is touching, he's pointing to his heart. And from his heart you can see there are two rays of light that are flowing from the heart of Jesus Christ. There is one ray of light which is reddish, the other which is pale, white, bluish. Those are the two rays of light flowing from this image. That brings us back to Good Friday, because Good Friday, what happened after Jesus died, is that his heart, his heart was pierced with a lance, and from his heart flowed blood and water. The blood would be the red, and the water would be the whitish. And these are symbolic of two sacraments. The pale color symbolizes the sacrament of baptism, which washes us our souls uh, of original sin, as well as the sacrament of, of confession, which forgives our sins after baptism. The red color is symbolic of the greatest sacrament, which is the sacrament of the Eucharist, the body, blood, soul, and divinity of Jesus Christ. Then, you can see his hands and his feet that there are nail wounds so this is an image of the risen Jesus Christ. And last but not least, Jesus wanted her to have written the words below, Jesus, I trust in you. Jesus, I trust in you. So my friends, all of us should uh, have the image of divine mercy in our homes, but also engraved within our hearts.